little kitty. You are still trying to make this rat disappear? Well, with practice, most things are possible. But imagine if rats actually disappeared from the earth. Well, that's the situation we will explore by answering a visible question. What if all rats disappeared? Zoom in! Rats are medium-sized rodents that have short hair, a long naked tail, rounded upright ears, protruding eyes, a pointed snout with a long whisker and five toes on each foot. Though they originated in Asia and Australia, later when humans started voyaging, these creatures hopped along and as a result, now they are found all over the world with over 60 different species. Despite their partnership in our adventures, these small animals have a bad reputation in our society and are often looked down on due to their history of being a medium for many diseases like Hantavirus, Salmonella and especially the Black Death Plague during the medieval period which was spread by fleas that lived on rats. On top of that, they are often associated with unsanitary conditions and are notorious for causing damage to our homes as their sharp teeth and constant gnawing can damage electrical wires, pipes and even concrete leading to expensive repairs. So, no wonder many people despise them and at times wish for a rat-free world. Well, I understand the concerns surrounding these small bags of mischief. But we need to remember that it's not their fault. Yes, my dear friends, rats are only trying to survive just like any other animals around us. Plus their mischiefs are a small price we pay for the role they play in maintaining the balance of our ecosystem. So, let us see what would happen if rats go extinct tomorrow. Well, if such a scenario arises, then expect your surrounding to litter up as, believe it or not, rats are responsible to do the cleaning job. Yes, as we know, rats are scavengers and opportunistic eaters as they will eat garbage and other things that people throw away. So, without them, much of this waste will remain around us, spreading diseases that will put pressure on the government to spend more money on sweeping work. Next, as we know, rats play an important role in the food chain as prey for many predators such as eagles, snakes and other animals. So it means without rats, these predators would have to find other sources of food or even they might become endangered. And if you think it won't hamper our food stock, then think again, as rats also help to spread seeds from plants, which is important for the growth and the survival of many plant species. They also play a role in the decomposition process by helping to break down organic matter, which is important for soil, health and nutrient cycling. So in short, no rats means the balance of our ecosystem will go for a toss. But at the same time, I understand that there are a few problems associated with having too many rats around us. So for that, I'll request you to all please adopt human ways to deal with them. And instead of using rat poisons and lethal traps to catch them, use non-lethal traps that are designed to capture the rat alive so it can be released elsewhere. And to prevent rats from coming into our homes, we should clean up any food messes and make sure to throw away our garbage properly. 
Remember, we can be kind to rats and still keep them from causing trouble in our homes. Trivia time! Did you know a group of rats is called a mischief? Also, a single rat can leave 25,000 droppings in a year. Sketching time! Today, the sketch of the day goes to Aisha Nadeem. Hope you learned something environmentally friendly today. Until next time, it's me, Dr. Binox, zooming out. Oh, wow! That's wonderful, Kitty!